Okay, well, I didn't know if this thing was actually working or not. But, as you can see in the background here, my room, my gaming room, is all tore up. I got boxes everywhere. I got stuff I'm getting rid of. And as you can see behind me, and currently this is semi down for the count until at least I want to say towards the end of the month I mean I've even got my gaming fridge defrosting and that but I've got where we're packing up stuff slowly taking stuff down off my walls all my gaming shelves and stuff are down this place my gaming area is a complete nightmare you know, I mean, I've got all my collectibles starting to get boxed up. I still got a bunch of Funkos to go through. You know, I'm not taking the glass shells because I've moved those things four times and I'm just done fucking with them for the money. I'll probably just go like some kind of other shelving setup for my Funkos. But at the moment, as you can see, I still got my light ups and Eddie Hall and my Santa stuff up on the wall. Here's a fireplace slowly coming down, as you can see. All my collectibles are starting to get boxed up there. Wife's been getting boxes from work. Those boxes there are actually kitchen stuff and miscellaneous. There's some garbage on there that's got to go out. Um, however, and then of course there's our geocache I took off the house. So if you ever geocache, our house has one called Naughty or Nice Trackable Hotel. And that's technically it. I pulled it off last night. I think last night. But as you can see, my room is just a bomb going off because we are moving due to the fact that next door has aggressive dogs right out our door and I don't think you're gonna be able to see them nope there it is Let's see if we can get it see that big those two dogs there they roam around off leash and that one goes after my wife all the time and chases anything in the neighborhood so we are moving by choice we have been looking since my shoulder went out last year and we finally found a landlord and a place which is funny because literally we're staying on the same street but we're moving other side of town on the same street so it is what it is um but yeah so this is just a quick update to all my subscribers i think i lost one somewhere in there on uh, my followers sorry man um if you follow me i appreciate it if you're willing to stick it out I appreciate it. Like I said, right now, you know, I got to tear my whole office set up down. I got my printer and all my gear. I got my CB set up. I got to disassemble all of this off my desk. Well, I mean, I just got to do the mic and then I got to take this part off. And then maybe, I don't know, at least take the controller off. The controllers all got to come off. I got to pack up my monitors, my mics, my stands. All this has been kind of a, I'm putzing at it. I've got another couple of weeks to work on it, but it's just a lot going on. And with our kids, we're dealing with them too. So between work, kids, grandkids, my wife, who's working a lot. So, you know, I got to keep her happy with tropical smoothies and butt rubs. Um, and I know she's watching this because I hear the echo. She always gets mad at me. She's like, how do you always hear this stuff? Uh, I was a radio signal specialist woman. I hear the little whispers that most people don't want to ha have anybody hear. Yeah, I'm turning red, aren't I? I'm really red this season. But because of my wife, look, I got some gray in there. That's because of my wife right here, this gray stretch. Oh, there she is. But anyways, so the North Pole is getting torn down. And as you can see back there, like for us, the... We're getting new couches, so this couch is staying, this, and then the love seat staying. The whole entertainment thing's going. We're getting new curtains and everything for the new place. We're getting some new stuff, new couch. The table that I repaired after my wife bought it from Rena Center that came where you touch it and it would go left and right. It wouldn't stay solid. Which actually, here's an example. Watch this. So this is how they were right out of the package when they brought them over to my wife you know so and down there actually is our cat's treat jug and we've got 10 pounds of weights on it because um which this house is just a complete disaster this one up here and his sister literally broke into that yellow bag of treats 
I found it on the couch this morning after the wife got home, tore open, and the only person that tears it open a certain way is Wednesday. So she literally picked it up, walked over to the couch, tore it open, and I found it that way. But in a nutshell, yeah, we're, we're packing up, and a lot's going on in between work, and kids, family. I get on and I play like, if, you're, if you want to follow me on stream, it's Scottish St. Nick. Um, on Steam, and then any social media is Scottish Saint Nick, just like my, you know, thing is. And um, yeah, like I said, it's just life is is taking over right now. I get on, I play Timberborn. Um, I pretty much beat both the Iron Tooth and then the easy version. And right now I'm playing it Iron Tooth on a really difficult level, where I'm our difficult map. I do want to get the rest of the, what is it, the Arkansas trips done, so if I get on, I might play, but I don't know if I'll stream, because literally, like, I don't know, to me, this, when I look in the background, and I see all this crap going on, as an ADHD person, it's just kind of where, like, fuck this, I'm going back to bed, you know, so... I can't guarantee. I know I won't have another fireplace at where we're going. Um, by the way, we do love uh, Smoky Mountain Moonshine. We drink it only when we're frustrated, which has been a little uptick lately. But yeah, that's all for my business i got to pack down. Which the wife inherits a couple of these. So she'll get at least one of the big ones and one of the medium ones. Small one's mine for batteries. And by the way, wife, if you're listening, this box up here is where all the bulbs go. I already have a box from when they sent us a whole bunch. But anyways, I'm going to keep it at that. Um, like I said, you know, I'm just going to tear all, i got to get up here and tear all this down. And then, you know, it's just a lot of, lot of work. And like I said, wife and I both agreed we're not taking the glass shelves. I put them in these walls, and it's probably the last time I was going to put them up anyways when we moved here. I'm going to probably do shelving like like this, and probably just get the skinniest shelving I can get, because I don't need a deep for Funkos. So, anyways guys, I'm Scottish St. Nick. Thank you for watching this. If you do, I will probably make this a highlight video on my channel for a while. Um, just stuff's going on. It's not that I don't want to play, it's just I just don't know... I don't want to sound like I'm bitching. I know it's my stream. You know, it's my channel. I know it's my stuff. And I just realized the cat feeder just got unplugged when I was unplugging stuff. And it's going, please plug me in or the cats won't get fed. I don't feel like dying. Snowball already attacked me last night. He, uh, man, my beard is looking kind of sexy, ain't it, woman? My wife was saying my beard's really looking, uh, you know. Tell you what, it's coming in pretty good compared to last year. Last year, I wasn't even down to here. Of course, my wife's down to here. She can't reach controller. Just joking. Um, I'm going to get my ass kicked. Anyways, I guess the wife's up. I'm going to talk to her. We both work nights now. Um, that's the other thing is, like, for my job, i kind of been in limbo. Uh, they did a background. They do a yearly background check, and for some reason, they still have my old license on file. So I got paused for doing work. So right now, I've lost... Two, four, six, about eight hundred dollars this week. Six hundred dollars, eight hundred dollars this week. So I'm a little pissed. So it might turn into I'm going to have to work a lot of midnights and overnights and push out about a couple, like all the way up till we move. Like working is what it is. You want new stuff, new bed, new sleigh bed that we want. It's about two hundred bucks. We want a new dresser for the room. Get rid of the one we have because it's a hodgepodge when we moved in here for the location. Um, new couch, that's another thing we got to do. Um, little things. Things we are taking, fridge, sub-freezer, washer-dryer, mattress. Our two computer desks, wife's got her gaming desk. You, you're let, the wife's lucky I don't come up and show your, her pink puke room. Like when I say pink, I mean like Pepto pink. Like her gun holster for her new gun is pink. And when I bought her gun, I thought it was going to be pink, but it's more like a magenta pink. So it's okay, but still it's pink. Anyways, of course, all of her gear's pink. Headphones. Oh, yeah, she's, she's pink. 
I know if I want to buy anything for my wife, buy it in pink and I'm okay. Or purple. Purple or pink. I'm never going to leave your room alone. I built that shit. Anyways, this is Scottish St. Nick saying, uh, hi, how you doing? How's it going? If you want to get in touch with me, you can go through my Discord or you can uh, follow me over on Steam. Uh, if you've got Steam for doing gaming and stuff. Um, or you can message me via Twitch if you watch it on Twitch. Um, don't forget to like and like and follow. You can also go over to my YouTube channel, which airs all my stuff, including my original trucking videos, which unfortunately is with my ex-wife. However, with the permission of my wife, um, they're up only because they're just trucking videos and they just get views for the channel when I'm not doing my other shit. So I'm going to go. It's been about 11 minutes and my right shoulder's killing me today because I've been taking shelves and stuff down. So y'all have a good one. Stay safe out there. This is Scottish St. Nick, confused as hell and getting ready to deal with his wife. See you guys later.